Hedera, I am Giuseppe Corcella from Virtual Orchestration and today I'm going to review Atlantis 3 by Zero G. Atlantis 3 is a library created and produced by Stefano Maccarelli and first of all I would like to thank Stefano for kindly sending us a copy of the library to review. This update brings the already outstanding Ethereum Gold Atlantis 2 to an even higher level introducing new ways of singing and expanding the sonic palette towards several singing styles and genres from Viking to Celtic to Fantasy and Ethereal to Epic and Heroic. It features uh, six singers, Clara Sorace, Lara Ausensi, Rosaria Angotti, Elena Borroni, Giulia Colantonio e Livia Cangialosi. It usually sells for $139.95 plus VAT, but at the time of this the review is on Enterprise for $111.95 plus VAT. Owners of any other Ethereum product are eligible for a 30% loyalty discount and owners of Ethereum Gold Atlantis 2 can upgrade to this version for $50 plus VAT. It runs in the full version of Contact 6.7 Point one or above, therefore it does not run in the free version of Contact downloads via the Contact Library Manager. Besides the original patches, you have quite a few new NKI files featuring new vocal styles, such as uh, Heroic, True Legato, a kind of epic vocal style. You have then the Fantasy, True Legato, Firenze, True Legato, featuring a kind of Renaissance vocal style. Dark Siren True Legato is a humming mysterial kind of vocals. Roma True Legato features a vocal style similar to the one of the Gladiator movie, to name some. I really suggest to check out the manual and the official walkthrough to get a complete overview of how this library works and tips to get the best out of it. There are also patches including a builder where you can assign to the slots a phrase from the list on the patches you can control a few parameters such as attack, sustain, decay, release, activate legato on the vocal phrases and sync them to the tempo in your sequencer. And then you have an effects rack with quite a few effects such as reverb, compressor, EQ, distortion you can use to shape the sound. The hybrid vocals have the Elements Modern Scoring Synth engine and you can install some presets using the installer inside the library's folder. One interesting tool in the vocal phrases is the Legato option, which lets you glue together different parts of two separate vocal phrases. You can also sync them to the tempo in your sequencer and pitch them if you need a different key, just be sure not to go too far to avoid any annoying artifact due to sample stretching. Recently Stefano released also an upgrade with some fast True Legato patches which let you play also some indeed fast True Legato passages. And now let's try this library and hear how it sounds.
Okay, for me the Ethereal Gold series is hands down one of the best, if not the best, collection of solo vocal libraries out there. With this upgrade of Atlantis, Stefano adds an important stone to this series. Atlantis 3 is not just an upgrade, but it feels like a brand new library, with new and improved graphics, improved samples and a lot of new patches and sounds. This is a kind of ultimate female vocal library toolkit with several singing styles from different places and times, but also it goes into the hybrid world thanks to some pad patches and the new hybrid vocals which takes advantage of the elements modern scoring synth engine. It's always about vocals, but there you can blend them together with other instruments like piano and create something unique thanks to this engine. I really love the presets that remind to that kind of vocals you can hear in Arrival. The overall sound is top notch and the vocal phrase is amazing. Stefano added also a few pad or percussion sounds to them you can trigger with some keys so you could actually use just one patch to create a song or most of it. The phrases blend beautifully together and you can use them polyphonically, getting the feeling of having multiple singers to perform your piece. And they work just great. I also enjoy a lot uh, the adding of a heroic, true legato vocal style, so this is a great sounding library that works just great in all kinds of uh, cinematic and film music, so versatile that allows you to score stuff inspired to very different ages and places. In a future upgrade, I would really love to see some vocal phrases also for the legato patches that do not have them yet. That sounds so good that you really feel like you are missing something without them. It's all for today, I hope you enjoyed this video, if you want to support virtual orchestration, subscribe to the channel, join our newsletter if you wish, hit the like button, not forget to click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we release a new tutorial or a new review. If you are new to the world of the virtual orchestration and you wish to learn more about it, or even if you are a pro or semi pro looking to improve your skills, we offer private online lessons about virtual orchestration, mock up programming, how to use Doric or Sibir to skip the Logic Pro. Get in touch at info at virtualorchestration.it. I wish you a wonderful day and see you on the next review.